Hello, Andrew Thompson from Precision Market Trading. Um, you'd be aware now from my previous videos that we forecast back in February a top coming around the 13th of April. That came on the day and now we're seeing quite a serious decline down here. The banks especially getting hammered, but overall um, everyone's turned a bit negative on the economy and the market. Uh, but me, we are looking for a low on Monday. As you know, I always do long-term stuff to get my short-term trading. It makes it stronger signals. We go back all the, all the way back here to uh, August uh, 2011. We had a major low down there. And up till Monday, I'm looking for Monday as a low. It's 949 trade, low to low. We had a, uh, another decent low here back in June. You'll see that on my um, my 867 forecasts. Um, you look at that one, we had a good run there and we got that top and down to there. So from that low on the 25th of June to Monday is 475, which is 50%. So 50% is a very good market. People always think, people always looking for 50% retracements or 50% retracements. Well, if you're, gonna, if you're looking for those, you're gonna go hungry because they rarely happen. Happens a fair bit in intraday markets, but not, not on the short to medium term. So 949, 475, that's 50% of that. Um, on a shorter term basis, we had a double bottom through here. Um, Monday's 144 trade, we've talked a lot about the 144, 288, so on sequence. Very strong in the Australian market. And it's 145 days on Monday too. So when I get these and these coming up and 50% of this, and there's a bit else, uh, there's a bit more in here, um, but I'm not gonna put it up here, it makes the chart too confusing. But I'm looking for a low on Monday to at least a bounce, I'm not calling it. The low, I think we've got a bit more to come down here, a little bit of this to work out. Too much price, not enough time. So once we get through here, um, I think we have a long-term buy. But this is a short-term place to cover your shorts. And maybe if you're a real aggressive uh, trader, to have a go at some of the old sold um, shares or then the SPY futures. So we'll see how it goes, but Monday's my pick for a low. Um, I'll talk to you soon and see how it went.